Hi everyone, Joe for jazzpiececasebreaks.com coming at you with another bounty break. 2022-23 Panini Prison Basketball. Four box, pick your team number 12. Final four boxes of this case. The next four box break is in the store right now. Next four boxes from a fresh case. Big thanks to everybody here for making it happen. Appreciate it. We've been really close. We, I mean, we've been pulling some nice stuff here, but we've been really close to unlocking some real nice bounties here as well. Maybe we'll get one in this break. Ryan Harold, Last Bond Mojo, Detroit Pistons. You know what they say? 70% of the time, Last Bond Mojo hits 100% of the time. There are the bounties that we're looking for right there. We're getting, we want exactly these numbers. If we get exactly 196 out of 299, we're giving away $1,500 of break credit to whoever has that card with that number. There you go. We'll keep that on hand right there. Good luck. We've got a triple header going on in basketball today. TNT triple header. The Lakers game was the uh, was an ABC game. Oh, my Lakers with a nice little opening game of the series. Still a long ways to go, but they beat the Grizzlies one twenty eight to one twelve without Anthony Davis or LeBron James having like some sort of ridiculous game. That's a good sign. Heat beat the Bucks 130 to 117. I think the Heat have lost Tyler Hero with a broken hand. And I, I don't know if has anyone heard any word on Giannis's condition. He landed on his bottom. I think he landed on his tailbone. Which is kind of painful. If anyone's ever done that, I have. Not on a hardwood basketball floor, but the carpeted floor still hurts though. Clippers. Uh, beat the Suns, 115 to 110. No Paul George, no problem. Kawhi Leonard, 38 points. Suns wasting a 27-9 and 11 day from uh, from Kevin Durant. And at halftime, Nuggets lead the Timberwolves, 55 to 44. All right, Amari Stoudemire reveals a Johnny Juzang. Sensational rookie auto. Sorry, I forgot. I forgot Utah drafted UCLA as Johnny Choosing. It was fun to watch. Logan, what's what's where where's where's he at these days? I don't know if Logan's still listening. Amari Sodemeyer to one forty nine. What uh, what happened at the ending of the dot? I, all I saw was Freddie Freeman strike out. Which is unlike Freddie Freeman striking out four times in the game. The rare golden sombrero for, for Freddie Freeman. These red waves are not numbered. It's Tyus Jones to 99, 12 out of 99, just a little bit off the, the bounty. That's going to go to Memphis. That'll be for uh, that'll be for Jake. It's Carl Anthony Towns to 56 out of 199. Yeah, well, I'm sure. We'll look at the umpire scorecard tomorrow. See how bad it was, but I'm sure the I'm sure the ump was bad for for both teams. So you got to adjust for that. What's BS is is the Dodgers having runners in scoring position and unable to being unable to convert more runs a couple innings earlier. There's Tari Eason. 
for Houston. That's going to go to Tristan. Rex, am I a breakfast bowl kind of? What is, what is, what is a breakfast bowl? I've made a breakfast that goes into a bowl, so I guess yes. There's uh, Marjan Beauchamp for Milwaukee. That'll be for Chris Butler. Chet Holmgren, nice. And behind Jason Preston is a Vince Williams Jr. Rookie autograph for Memphis. That's going to be for Jaike. The Jason Preston, 124 out of 299. No, we need 196 out of 299. That just sounds like breakfast to me. <laughs> so yes, I guess I am. I don't put it. In, I don't put that in a bowl though. They're usually uh, they're usually on a plate. It's plated nicely. I probably subtract cheese or gravy, but bacon's definitely there. Sausage definitely there. Eggs are definitely there. Some sort of potato is definitely there. There's Vince Carter to one twenty-five. So you're asking if I like breakfast. I do love breakfast. I'll often have, I'll, I'll, I've been known to have breakfast for dinner. That's to 125. There's a Paolo Banchero. Luck of the Lottery Silver Benedict Mathurian. Am I ready for summer? Yeah, I'd like. I am ready for summer. I'm always ready for summer. I'd like it to be here soon. My abs are not ready for summer, though. I did lose a lot of LBSs, but from last summer to this summer, so I guess that's an improvement. No, I don't go to I don't go to the gym. I just train I just train like Rambo. No, not like Rambo. I train like same guy, but I, I train like Rocky. In the in the Rocky where he goes to Russia and he's just lifting rocks and running through like four feet of snow. Jason said the other day, he says, sees me as a snacker. Yeah, that's probably right. I've, uh, I generally like to eat, it's like a smaller meal throughout the day. So in the morning I'll have like a, a tea and maybe, maybe, maybe some hard boiled eggs, maybe some scrambled eggs with some potatoes, some bacon. You know, and then maybe I'll come here and I'll have like a little English muffin that I may have toasted up with some butter and marmalade and have a little coffee with that. 
57 out of 199. That Kelly Olenek will go to the Jazz. You know. No, I don't do crumpets. Too dry. Too dry. Yeah, I'll, I just, I, I'll eat smaller, smaller meals throughout the day instead of, like, large meals. Unless it's a nice dinner. It's, it's on the weekend, it's a little different. There's Anthony Davis to 125 for the Lakers. There's a Jaden Ivey for the Pistons. That'll be for Ryan. For people to say, yeah, I mean, I think it really, really doesn't matter frequency or size of a meal, but. But yeah, some people say eat smaller meals throughout the day. Some people say eat three larger meals. There's Max Christie, 226 out of 299. We need 196 out of 299. Max Christie going to my Lakers. That'll be for Greg. Um, five star is a weird size. We usually put them in these 180 top loaders, but I think if you've ever received five star from us, most of the time they'll have painter's tape on here so they don't slide out. But they're, they're a, a tiny bit, because the next size down is 130. They're kind of between 130 and 180. If they ever made like a 1, 70 top load or something like that. It might be perfect. But they don't make that size. So top should really just cut it to a more common top loader size. But yeah, that, that's, what, that's what we do. Did Trendsetter get self-conscious about his his uh, weight goals. Here's a Kenneth Lofton to 149. No, we need 199. And we got a Jalen Green for Houston. Another Kenneth Lofton Jr. rookie silver for the Grizzlies. Let me for Jaik Joe. Lara, what's going on? Have I seen Monopoly prison basketball? What in the world? You know what? Actually, now that you mention it, I think I have heard of it. You're actually talking about the game Monopoly, but with prison basketball? Like parallels or something like that on it? Or players? I feel like I've heard someone talk about that. 
It seems to jog something in the the caverns of my brain. Wait, no, it's not the game. No, then I don't know what you're talking about. I'm intrigued though. I do enjoy the game Monopoly. Wait, can you pull cards out of here too? I'm looking at it right now. Here's the link to target to the target on there. Uh, the link is too long. Well, you can you can just search it. I'm sure you guys know how to use Google. Um, that's kind of cool. Collect, trade, compete. Yeah, it's the actual Monopoly game, but with different teams around the board. Jail is you're in timeout. Free parking, still free parking. This looks interesting. But what are the what are the cards look like? Are they do they have Monopoly logos on them or something like that? Someone so pull, someone pulled a Steph Curry color blast out of there. All right, behind a red Paolo Banchero, which is really nice. There's Marcus Smart for the C's. That's going to go to Jennifer and the Celtics. And here's red rookie Paolo Banchero, 154 out of 299. Imagine if it was a bounty and this red Banchero. But still nice, Jonathan, with the Orlando Magic. Just like all the regular prisms, but has a Monopoly logo. And that's kind of sick, actually. I'm not sure if I have too much interest in the game itself with the, with the different places where you can land being like different basketball teams and stuff. But I do like the idea of the carts out of there. So it's it's forty dollars. It's forty dollars for the game, which has cards inside. I wonder if people are buying the games just for the cards and then just throwing away the game. All right, you should donate it. Donate it to a local local boys and girls club or something like that. It's Patrick Baldwin Red Wave for the Warriors for Canard. There's an Isaiah Mobley, rookie hyper. And a Jaden Hardy to 125. Yeah, Mobley will go to Chris and the Cavs. Someone's saying a Banchero color bass monopoly car for 20. Yeah, I'll bet with those prices, I mean, $40 is what? The cost, just a little over the cost of a standard blaster box these days? Aren't blaster box like 30 bucks? What are we selling our basketball blaster boxes for? I don't know if you have any prison blasters out there. But... It's about the cost of a blaster box, right? 40 bucks? Or a little bit higher than, the, than a blaster box, a prison blaster box? Just buy the game. Donate the game to, <laughs> to a, a local charity or a... Something like that and keep the cards. Oh, they have a proper Monopoly blaster box that's 30 bucks. Okay, then that makes more That makes sense. Should we make a, a Jaspie's Monopoly game? I need a good... Uh, I wish Monopoly would have done a, a better job at 
making the game easy to play on a mobile app. Do they have them? They must have a mobile app, right? We got Tyrese Martin for the Hawks. It's William with Atlanta. Man, a Joe Jaspi color blast? That'd be pretty sick. There's Dwayne Wade to 149. Can you imagine? It's me doing my classic train whistle. We're like, woo woo. All right, and then the blast of color behind me. Ooh, a Chet Holmgren purple. 32 out of 99. 24 out of 99 is the bounty, but we'll take a 32 out of 99 Chet Holmgren. Matthew Shira with OKC. There's Amari Stoudemire, 59 out of 199. We need 100 out of 199, not quite, but this will go to the Suns. It'll be for Allen. Suns fell to the Clippers today. Denver is up 64-48, 8.03 left in the third. And there's the other Jalen Williams. This is Arkansas Jalen Williams, who was... A later round pick, but both Williamses have been turned out to be pretty good. All right, fourth and final next four box break is from a fresh case. And that's our last case. If you're keeping track of our inventory, that's our last case for now, or at least at that price. All right, next box. Wow, I, I didn't realize they had so many Monopoly. So they have the classic Monopoly board game. They have a Monopoly Travel World board game. They've got a Monopoly Stranger Things. There's a Monopoly Cheaters edition. What in the world is this? I don't. I don't like cheaters. Follow, bend, or break the rules to win the cheater's edition of a Monopoly. Cheating is part of the game. Wow. Includes plastic handcuffs? That's hot. Don't get caught. This Monopoly game includes a plastic handcuff that chains cheating players to jail space. Cheat cards encourage players to cheat and which cheat to attempt. Wow. Just really leaning into the cheating. And it's ages eight and up. Unbelievable. This is un unbelievable. Let's we some some uh, surely some uh, religious group will get that game canceled. There's a pri Monopoly Prison Basketball Edition. There's Monopoly Super Mario Movie Board Game Edition. There's a Target Edition. There's a Discover Edition. There's a Secret Vault Edition. There's a, wow. A Wakanda Forever Edition. That's crazy. Just classic for me. Thank you very much. Also, I, I always wish this would never happen just because... The turnover would be so... Unless they figure out a way to make the game faster. Which I'm sure they could. But um, to actually play Monopoly like in Vegas with real money. You know, so... There, there, but I don't know how that... But there'd be like a... 
you know, there'll be like a whatever, however much buy-in. You get those as chips and then you just play the game as you would. Jalen Williams, that's Arkansas edition, revealing a DeJunta Murray for the Hawks. That's going to be for Williams. It's 14 out of 25 for the ATL. It's for Williams. Tyrese Martin, rookie silver, also for the Hawks. That's for Williams. And the Jalen Williams red to 299. Oh, my gosh. Are you kidding me? Three off. It's 196 out of 299. Sorry, Matthew. Very close, but just, just not quite. Damn. I want to hit some bounties. Jordan Poole Blue revealing a Zaire Williams sensational signature. Memphis, that'll be for Jaik Joe. That's 40 out of 199. Jordan Poole for Kennard and the Warriors. Brandon Ingram purple, 12 out of 99. And the last half, Isaac Okoro, 296 out of 299, not 196. A lot of close calls here. Isaac Okoro going to Chris in Cleveland. Benedict Mathurian, Red Wave, not numbered. There's a Paolo Banchero base. That's going to go to Jonathan and Orlando. And there's Christian Braun. That's to 75. Denver. That's going to go to Dayton and Denver. Lamelo Ball Silver and Christian Braun at the end. All right, Dave, we got close to some bounties, but just not quite there. But I appreciate everyone giving it a shot. Thanks for watching, everyone. Nice Chet Holmgren Purple. Nice Paolo Red. Some nice stuff here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next basketball break. Bye-bye.